Well, I think it is very important because we are, uh, if I cite Armin uh, Gertz, he says that uh, our minds are encultured and embodied. Uh, talking as a historian, I must say that most of my colleagues took it for granted that we are encultured, but have many problems with us being embodied. They're just not ready to think about uh, human beings as, uh, as uh, f physical beings. And therefore, uh, this uh, interaction with people who treat mind as part of the body is very fruitful and gives a quite a different and, in my opinion, very interesting approach to, to history. Learning from different disciplines, in my opinion, is one of the best ways to do something new with your materials, because classical studies is a field which is very well studied. And uh, I get insights and inspiration sometimes from fields far uh, away from mine, say from prehistoric archaeology, from psychology. And uh, it is talking to people and then reading uh, things those people have uh, work on uh, that gives sometimes uh, ideas of doing things about uh, my own materials. A lot of them, and in fact what I must say that uh, this workshop went much smoother and people understood each other uh, uh, really uh, much better than during the previous um, sessions or, or, or meetings. So uh, this time it was particularly important to me uh, since I could, uh, I, I learned a lot from the way psychologists or, experiment, uh, or people who do experimental uh, uh, research look at the phenomena I study, for instance, prophecy and uh, sensory deprivation, all this stuff will, will be of great importance for me.